Welcome back to Satisfactory. I've got a coal plant here. We're gonna get it running. Uh, let's make another one. I think we can afford one more. Okay, just making sure we can run between the gap there. Uh, okay, now the coal is right here. Let's build a miner. Oh, somebody's angry at me. Ma'am, research complete. Okay, I want to bring the bowl around from here and just kind of swerve around here. Now we're going to need splitters. Oh, I can't jump on top of it. There we go. Oh. Uh, can I? Yeah, I want to bring this about here and then uh, bring it in. Yeah, that looks pretty good. We'll just use the uh, tier 1 belt for now. I don't think these will use... Well, I don't know how much... Um, coal they will use. But uh, I don't think... This will consume a full belt of 60. Both of these. I doubt it. But you never know. Alright, let me... I want to jump on top of this. There we go. Uh, now we need water. Does it say how much water... It requires 40... 45... Cubic meter... Meters per minute. Extraction rate... For water extractor is 120. Okay, so one extractor will support two generators, plus a little bit extra. Let's put it over here. Uh, no, actually... If I want to expand this, I should be expanding it right. I should be going that way. Oh, we got a little room either way. Yeah, I'll just put it on this side right now. Uh, before I do that... 
Let me have a look at the pipes. Pipeline. Pipeline support. Junction. Okay. Alright, now when I did this a long time ago, I did something like... I don't know if this is going to work, but... I want to get... I want, to, I want the piping to be raised above ground. Ground level. So we'll just make the pipe kind of go along here. Okay, and then delete all of this. There we go. If we hold control, it kind of lines them up pretty well. That works. Okay, now we can build the pump. Water extractor. Now, I think that should be okay, that... We shouldn't need a, um... A separate pump for this. It says, uh... Allows fluids to be transported 10 meters upwards. Yeah, so if we go higher than that... Then we need a pipeline pump. But, uh, I think this is okay. That doesn't, doesn't quite look like 10 meters to me. All right, now... Let's get some power poles down. all gotta be lined up just perfect all right that's all connected it all should work now we do have to jump start the process with 
a biomass burner. Is that enough power? I guess that is enough power to run um, the ore extractor and this 20 megawatts and the ore extractor 5 megawatts. We can actually reduce this uh, We want it 75? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. 90 uh, cubic meters per minute. That'll be enough to feed two coal extractors, which require 45 per minute each. Here comes the coal. Can I make another one? Uh, barely. Yeah, I brought enough... I brought enough, um, iron plates. Reinforced iron plates. I can make another one. Okay, well, let's get some some more piping here. Uh, yeah, this will work. Okay, we want to go. Hey, you didn't build it. Now this thing, sorry, we gotta get rid of you. Uh, junction. There we go. Actually, I'm just wondering if it would look better, the junction, if it didn't have that angle. Let's just try it and see what it looks like. I think I'd prefer that.
Well, now I have to make them all the same. Let's try this one uh, straight down. Well, it doesn't match up. Nah, okay. Never mind. That's better. Now, that will be consuming 135 cubic meters of water, which means we need another water extractor. Oh. Can't make it. Um, can I make a crack bench? Yes, I can. Can I make five reinforced iron plates? I did it. This isn't too pretty. Um, I guess it works. Let's take that. Uh, get rid of that connection. And we'll reconnect these with... And there goes the power. How do we lose power? I guess because we lost uh, water for that split second. First of all, okay, fine. Assumption 18.7, capacity 30. Yeah, they don't have water. We'll wait till they get water again and then we'll turn that on. building that water back up. Let's max that out. Should be working at 100%. Um, until we have enough water, let's disable one of these completely. Oh, it's got no connection anyway. Well, no need to disable it. Okay, production 150 megawatts. That's better. Uh, 
Uh, we'll keep that at 15%. We don't need much water from this one. Both of the, this one at 100% and this one at 15% will be enough to support three coal generators. And these will consume coal even if we're not using the power. It just consumes it at a 100% rate all the time. Ah, 15 per minute. Okay. So we're just using 45 per minute for these three. So we got plenty of coal to spare in case we want to um, add a few more generators. That'll be fine. Production 225 megawatts. That's a huge step up from, well, whatever we were at before. Look at those beautiful smokestacks. Alright, now we gotta get the power back. But first, there's a couple slugs here I wanna grab. More quartz. Where's that slug? There you are. Oh no. Got out of there before the gas could uh, hurt us. From the gas plant. Right, there's another slug up there. I don't know if I can get that one. Not easily anyway. I think I gotta jump across. We're going to do it this way. Ramps. Well, now that I'm up here... Let's see what's up here. Copper. I don't need it, obviously. I don't need to carry around this copper ore, but... The fact that these little deposits here. I don't like leaving them around. They just bug me, so I'm gonna throw that away. Do I see anything interesting? Not really.
Does that reveal some of the map? Yeah, it does. Ah, there's a rock. Guterium. Yes, gimme. New technologies can be developed based on this new, superconductive, gold-like element, primarily in power and electronics. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Ow. Another slug. I don't think I need any more of the ore. Basically, all I want is the ability to scan for the ore. And just a little bit will be enough for that. Um, Alright, there's a slug up there. Right? I saw a slug. I know there's a yellow one there. I can hear it. Oh god. Back. Safe. as well. Alright, I don't want to spend too much time out here. I want to get back. Uh, let's grab that yellow slug. see with all these plants around. Can't get to me. Reacher is in the way. What is that thing? Is that a new type of, um... I don't even know what these are called. The hogs? It's like a radiated hog? Alright, I see more interesting stuff, but... I can't get uh, carried away with all that right now. I gotta get this power back to my factory. All this poor coal going to waste. Oh, jeez. Almost knocked me off. Take those hog remains.
Okay. We're done with that. We got a few slugs. Including a yellow slug. That's nice. Uh, let's just extend this. Get a nice bridge going. So we go through this pathway here, take a left, and take a right here, and straight ahead. See if we can find our way out. Should be this way, yes. Now. Manta ray. There he goes. Huh. Go away. Oh, he's going to follow me all the way back home. Almost there. Uh, let's bring it in up here. Uh, let me get up there. Okay, I suppose we'll just connect it here for now. And uh, I'm going to have to refactor all of this. Now that we have extra power capacity, that means we can expand quite a bit. I'm not going to refactor it now, but um, before things get too messy and out of control. We can do that. Now we scanned our hard drive. Let's see what we get. The analysis of hard drive is completed. Select your desired reward. Now as far as I remember, the bolted iron plate and the bolted 
brain, they do not use less resources. Than the original recipes. They're just faster. But I don't care about this wire. Five ingots, iron ingots for a wire. Finding copper is not going to be an issue. Um, I guess I'll take it. Alright, what can I get? Sting your research? Do it. I got some new stuff to research. I want this. Cost three protein and a thousand cable. No problem. Basically, any chance I got... Any chance I get to increase my inventory capacity... I'm taking that. Now, I need a lot of cables. How many? A thousand? Yeesh. I think I had a bunch of cable in here too. Yeah, that's fine. Plus six inventory slots. I'll take it. What else do we get? A hand equipment slot. Well, we need steel for that. Uh, the rebar gun, I kind of... I'd like to get that. I don't think I have the... Iron plates for it. Medical inhaler. 50 rotors. Let's, uh, let's research the Katerium. Ah, crap. I should have got more of it. I thought I needed, like, one Katerium to start this process. Nope. I gotta find six more. That's fine. That's okay. Uh, Mycelia. Rewards, fabric. Oh, that means we can get uh, parachutes. Yeah, and I remember um, parachutes used to be consumables, and they weren't really that useful. I guess they were useful if you were good at using them, but the way that they were used, it... I, I don't know how to explain it. I would use it, and then I would use it again because I thought that my first click didn't register and then I would wind up putting the parachute away as I was in the air and fall to my death and it was just so clunky clunky uh, but now I'm eager to try it out uh, let's grab some biomass so we can unlock it yeah I never really used parachutes before and they were I guess they weren't expensive. Where's my biomass? Oh, I'm just feeding it into here. Alright, well, I'll make some biomass. Oh no, don't use my mycelia. Use my leaves. I think Massalia we can use for other things. Fabric? If I'm right, it's used for fabric, so I don't want to use it for biomass. Uh, let's see. Let's uh, research fabric. Hey, there we go. Parachute, 10 fabric. How do I make fabric? Yes. Now we have 13 fabric. 
So this will give us, we can research it. I don't think we'll be able to make the parachute with three fabric left. The analysis of parachute is complete. Oh, I want that too. So much good stuff. Um, I can research the yellow power shard. Oh, wait. Okay, can't research the purple power shard. Now, how do we make a parachute? 20 fabric. Okay, so I need to find more Mycelia. And uh, there is a... a... Synthetic polyester fabric. Yeah, so this is a... A way to make fabric from... Plastic, I think. Gives us a new recipe. That'll come in handy. Alright, so we researched a bunch of stuff. Can we do anything else? We can do the protein inhaler. Yeah, let's do it. It requires the rotors, and those are kind of valuable for me right now, but we've been away from the base for quite a while. I think we've got a bit of a stockpile. All right. No bullets. I think that'll do it for now. All right, so we've got... Let's look at our power capacity. Uh, production, 225 megawatts. And we're consuming 203? Oh, capacity 445. Okay. Um, oh, right. I think because... Production 225, that's coming from... Hold on. 75 each. Yeah, so 225, that's coming from the coal plants. And uh, capacity is 445. That's because the... Biomass burners should be off. Yeah, they're not. It's not using the biomass burners anymore. Okay, so we've about doubled our capacity, I think. Alright, now that gives us some... Um, some room to expand, I think. We'll build a new... We'll utilize the other um, iron node up here a bit more. So we can get more reinforced iron plates and rotors. We're going to be using a lot of those. And uh, so we need to bump up production on those. And um, I think that's what we'll do next time. Yep. Pretty happy with our progress so far. It's just going to get messier. Oh boy. Oh boy.